you know, each country has their own unique, special things. And here's the five things I only know after I come into Australia. So, before I came to Australia, I know that it's famous for kangaroos and the koalas. But I didn't know that there are so many kangaroos. You know the population of kangaroos in Australia is 50 million. Where the population of human beings is 25 million. And also it's not recommend driving in the suburbs after sunset as you might hit kangaroos. This is crazy. And also you can eat kangaroos. They are yummy. Um, actually some Australians think some Australians consider kangaroos to be pests. So when I just arrived in Australia, I was looking for a share house and I saw many posters wrote Five phone welcome and I was like why is five phone? But as I stayed in Australia longer and I started to meet Aussie friends, I realized that FIFO is a type of job. No, no, so Perth is a mining city. There are a lot of mining sites up to north and they are far, far, far away from city. So FIFO means flying, fly out. So people fly to their work for like one or two weeks to stay there and working 12 hours a day and fly back to home for one week and yeah that, that, that's five for So in Australia, you can drink water from the tap. It's nice, right? So convenient. But like sometimes it gets some test. Anyway, so if you want to buy a bottle of water, it's not that cheap though. And the funny thing is sometimes the juice and the milk is, is cheaper than a bottle of water spring water but, say, but sadly I really drink milk or juice but it's good to you can just drink water from the tap mm. I remember the first time I saw cockatoo and the parrots in the park I was like oh my god it's amazing they are free Free birds! <laughs> As in my country, Taiwan, you can only see them in cages. Um, yeah, so here you can see them in the park, on the streets, or on the utility poles. It's so amazing. I love the beach, and the beaches in Western Australia are breathtaking. I love it so 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 much. So when I came to Australia, uh, it was winter time. So of course the water was cold. But um, when the summer came, I was so excited. I was like, yes, beach time! So I went to the beach and I jumped into the water. Oh my god, the water was freezing cold. I'm not joking, that was freezing cold. So I tell you what, in the Western Australia, it's Indian Ocean, so the water is always cold. Sometimes it's even freezing cold, even during the summer. Well, it is what it is, right? Uh, but I'm 
cold water is good for your body and good for your metabolism so it shouldn't be a reason to stop you going to a beach cannot say no to a beach can you? no, come on alright so these are the five things I share with you today I hope you like it don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you haven't and give this video a thumbs up subscribe subscribe I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Love you.